foldable phones, Hema, I have to ask you this. Do you prefer them or do you think they are the future? I think they're amazing. I would want yeah, our OG foldable phones OG to come foldable back. OG foldable phones. Those were the ones that you always, that make you nostalgic. It's the snap. It's the snap. <laughs> That's the most important feature of that phone, I'd say. <laughs> Well, it seems the wait is over as Samsung unveiled its latest smartphones, watches, tablets on Wednesday. The world's largest phone maker has gone all out to capture the premium phone market with the latest edition of foldable and flip phones. Exactly. Now, the company is appeasing the consumers with a bigger screen but also keeping it compact with the foldable technology which you can snap which he was just talking about. Right. And Samsung's present claims that the foldable phones are the future of the smartphone. Seems like we're back to the future now, but the product still caters to a niche audience, which is only about 5% of the total smartphone market. There's also the Galaxy Watch 6 and the Tab S9. We'll get you all the details on that, of course. Samsung is looking to accelerate its part to growth with the unpacked event. The Galaxy Z Flip 5 and the Fold Z 5 are thinner and their predecessors than their predecessors and also showcase an improved camera. Now, both models run on the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen, Gen 2 chipset. Notably, the price for the Flip 5 starts at $999, which comes about 82,000 rupees in Indian currency. Whereas the Galaxy Z Fold 5 is priced at $1,799, which is approximately 1,47,000 rupees. When we speak of the Samsung Galaxy Watch 6, it comes with updated health and wellness features. The Watch 6 price starts at $299, which is around 24,000 rupees. Interestingly, Samsung unveiled its devices way before Apple's annual September event. Perhaps it will give the South Korean giant the much-needed limelight in the smartphone market.